The Korean government is working hard to find a cure for COVID-19 among existing drugs instead of creating a whole new drug from scratch. There at least seems to be a silver lining as effective substances have been detected after a month of intense research. The search for a cure for COVID-19 is in full swing in a special lab at Institute Pasteur of Korea that's capable of handling the virus. This is how the research is conducted. First, animal cells are placed in multi-well plates. Some 3,000 candidate drugs are added. Then the animal cells are infected with COVID-19. Robotic arms rapidly conduct tests to find out which drugs show antiviral capabilities. The results are shown on microscopic images. Fewer fluorescent spots mean the drug effectively suppressed the virus. The Korea Research Institute of Chemical Technology used the same method to round up a group of promising drugs in just a month after launching the research. The two institutions picked cyclozonide used to treat asthma as a promising substance and also found that the tapeworm medication, niclozamide, can effectively suppress the virus even at low concentration levels. But Ebola medicine Remdesivir, which U.S. health authorities have been focusing on, was found to be most effective in fighting COVID-19. The Korean researchers also confirmed the effectiveness of malaria medication chloroquine. However, these drugs must be tested for safety and effectiveness for humans through clinical testing. It's hard to predict when these drugs can be prescribed to actual patients since it takes time to conduct animal testing and clinical trials.